Hello, I'm King Tut, and let me tell you became the youngest pharaoh alive. I was born Amarna. My father, Ankhon II, changed Egypt's capital from Thebes to Amarna and changed the religion of Egypt monotheistic at one point, worshipping only one god, Adam. When I was only nine, I was crowned king of Egypt, which was quite stressful considering I was only nine. I then married Anka Sanamun, which was my sister. However, stuff like that was common in Egypt and was our daily way of life. Sadly, I died due to what scientists still ponder about to this day. Scans shown I had clubfoot, malaria, walked with a cane, hunchback, and had an underbite. Yeah, talk about that. In 1922, a man by the name of Howard Carter rediscovered my tomb, which started the craze of Egypt. For 17 years, artifacts were stolen from my tomb, which allowed me to lay a curse on his friend. After years of research, two stillborn babies were found and examined in my sarcophagus. Also, some theories say that my coffin was originally made for a woman, and that the bust of Nefertiti might have also been fake. Even with all this trauma and for my age, I still managed to become king.